Drama almost halted the House's stimulus vote as U.S. COVID-19 cases grow past China's. This is your daily Radio.com coronavirus update. I'm Linda Lopez. The House has passed the $2 trillion coronavirus stimulus package despite last-minute drama. Kentucky Republican Thomas Massey pushed for a roll call vote, which meant congressional members would have to return to D.C. to make their vote in person. Massey was unable to get support, and the bill passed with a voice vote. His actions received bipartisan backlash from colleagues and President Trump. After a three-day rally, stocks sank today after news of the possible delay, with the Dow dropping 875 points after the opening bell. The S&P 500 and the Nasdaq both slipped more than 3 percent. The United States has passed China in coronavirus cases with nearly 90,000. This means the U.S. now has more positive cases than any other nation. In an attempt to slow these numbers, L.A. has closed all beaches, trails and bike paths. The global count has passed half a million, and one of the new cases is another global leader. The UK's Prime Minister Boris Johnson tested positive and released a statement on Twitter. I am working from home, I'm self-isolating, and that's entirely the right thing to do. Uh, But be in no doubt that I can continue, uh, thanks to the wizardry of modern technology, to communicate with all my top team to lead the national fight back against coronavirus. In a touching moment, people from all across the UK joined together to thank healthcare workers. On Thursday evening, buildings were lit blue and people stepped out on balconies and front porches for a massive round of applause dedicated to the members of the NHS. For all the latest news on coronavirus, visit radio.com slash coronavirus. I'm Linda Lopez. Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, make sure to like and subscribe and hit that bell for all notifications from Radio.com. While you're at it, why don't you check out some of our other great videos?